There's a flood of new details coming in overnight about the man now in custody accused of attempting to assassinate Donald Trump yesterday. The second attempt on Trump's life. This morning, a picture is beginning, just beginning to come into focus about the man's past, including what he recently said about Trump himself. The FBI is working to piece this all together and figure out how and why he got a few hundred yards from Donald Trump with an assault-style rifle. The Secret Service spotting him, opening fire. As Trump was golfing, the would-be shooter then fled, taken into custody a short time later on a highway. Charges and a first court appearance could come as soon as this morning. There is a lot to get to surrounding all of this. Yes. Carlos Suarez is standing by for us in West Palm Beach near Donald Trump's golf club. What's the latest, Carlos? Good morning. What we hear from her coming out, what we hear from the Teamsters president coming out of that will be totally very fascinating. Coming up still for us, new reporting today. Trump's campaign was recently briefed on new indications Iran is planning, was planning to escalate attacks on the former president and those around him. We have this new CNN reporting coming in. That's next. And also more coming out this morning about the man now in, in police custody in connection with the apparent assassination attempt on Donald Trump, his background and his rap sheet as the state attorney in Palm Beach revealed.